Hi, this is a video on proportions. Um, a proportion is simply two equal ratios. So, for example, if I have uh, a ratio, which as you recall is comparing two things by division. So if I have a ratio of three fourths and I have another ratio that's equal to, for example, um, nine twelfths, that's a proportion. It's also two equivalent fractions, as you can see. Um, now, the neat thing about these is that um, I can do something called cross products. Um, and let's say I have three fourths, and I know it's equal to something else, but I'm not given the full things. Um, I'm given that's equal to 15 over x. Well, there's this property called cross products, and cross products is this idea, a over b, uh, if a over b is equal to c over d, then a d is equal to c b cross products. Um, you can figure this out on your own. If a, B is equal to C, D, and um, we multiply first both sides by B, and these cancel, and we get A is equal to C, B over D, and then multiply both sides by D, over here, and then we get what we were talking about, the AD, commutative property there, is equal to uh, BC or CB. So um, that's the idea of cross products. Back to this here, right here, um, we can use this to solve for an unknown here, X. We can go three times X is equal to 4 times 15, or 3x is equal to 60, divide each side by 3, and we get x is equal to 20. Um, we can also use this in problems. Um, here's one from a book. It says three posters cost nine dollars and sixty cents and then they ask at that rate how many posters can you buy for forty eight dollars well here's the dollar part down at the bottom what we don't know is how many posters we can buy and so we'll call that x we do cross products and we get three times 48 is equal to 9.6x. We divide both sides by 9.6. And if you do that, or you get out your calculator and do that, um, you end up apparently with x is equal to 15. So with that amount of money, we can buy 15 posters. So um, that's the end of this video on uh, proportions, which we'll be using a lot. And so I'll end up.